Welcome back to News Channel 18 at noon. Joining me this midday is Dennis Kaus of the Ohio Valley Refinery Roadshow and also Jake Weaver, who is the show manager here in Lafayette. And Dennis, I'll start with you guys. Um, we got a, a full table of, of items here, and right. you guys are having a show uh, all week here in Lafayette, and people right. can bring items such as these into right. and get those evaluated and right. hopefully walk away with some cash in their pocket. Absolutely. Uh, right now, gold and silver prices are all-time highs. Uh, gold last week hit $1,400 an ounce, which was never done in history. So an example right now, it's a good time for ladies to clean out their jewelry boxes, bring in, we, we even buy broken jewelry. Uh, guys bring in those old class rings you don't wear anymore. We also mm -hmm. buy dental gold. Uh, any sterling uh, jewelry as well. And then the old coins prior to 1965, like your silver dollars and dimes and half dollars and quarters, they were all made of 90% silver. Great time to cash those in as well. And Jake, we were kind of talking during the commercial break. Everything that's on this table is stuff that people from the Lafayette area brought in yesterday. Um, and it's Great. just items that, you know, pe people might have, have laying around. You know, it, they c what can they expect if they come out to the I, I, A guaranteed paycheck. Um, people bring in just everything, and uh, I can write you a check on the spot. Mm -hmm. And Dennis, you guys are going to go throughout mm -hmm. the state or throughout the country? Or? Right. We conduct about uh, 50 shows a week throughout the United States and Canada. So, uh, yes, we usually have two or three shows a week in Indiana. Um, but, yes, we'll be coming through usually about every six months. But now with the uh, high price of the precious metals, this is the time to cash in. We also buy some collectibles. <coughs> Jake here has a sword from World War II. So we buy a lot of war memorabilia, such as swords, bayonets, daggers, helmets, rifles. Also, vintage guitars is another big item right now with the collectors. This is an old vintage Gibson guitar. Uh, we actually buy more guitars than any company in the world. Um, so we have a lot of collectors for those. But also old baseball cards from the 50s and 60s. Um, also old comic books, 10, 12, and 15 centers uh, sure. is, is hot right now as well. But again, back to the gold and silver and the sterling. Uh, BN's all-time high. That's what most people are cashing in right now. And we got about 10 seconds left. And real uh -huh. quickly, if they want to come out, where do they go and where are the hours? <coughs> okay, I'll let Jake tell you that. At 163 uh, Frontage Road, mm -hmm. uh, we're right behind uh, Cracker Barrel. It's a town place suites. Yep. Okay. And we're here through Friday, uh, 9 to 6 through Thursday, and 9 to 4 on Friday. Okay. All right. Guys, thank you so thank much you for coming much. in today. Thank you very much. Thank you.